Hey, this is Mehdi with Full Stack Library, and in this video, we'll learn how to select one item from the Flex items and align it in the cross axis of the current line of the Flex container. So we have four items right here, and in order to align the items, all of the items, so we just need to define this align items right here, and we'll select Flex Star. Oh, in this case, you see that all of the items are packed at the star of the cross axis. Okay, but what if I want to just select one item, we'll go for the second one, and I want to align it at the bottom. I don't want this one, three, and four to be packed at the bottom or at the end of the cross axis. I just want to select the second one and pack it at the end of the cross axis. For that, we have a property align self, but before that, let's just select the second item. So we'll go for flexbox item, then I'll use this nth child to select the second one why I'm using this number two. And I use the probably align self. I have a similar to align items. So we have flex star, we have flex and we have also center, but let's just go for flex start. No, let's just go for flex end. And to take this item right here and put it at the end of the cross axis. Okay, let's just save that. But as you see, so the item is just moved from the top, from the start of the cross axis. To the end. I'm only selecting one item instead of multiple ones. Let's just go for the last one, this four right here, and I will align it at the center of the cross axis. Okay, let's just copy that. Then I will use four instead of two. And instead of flex end, I will use center. And the fourth element is just aligned at the center of the cross axis, not the main axis. This is the center of the cross axis. It is aligned. The fourth element is aligned at the center. So we can use the flex and flex start or wherever, but flex star will not see the difference here because we already aligned items at the flex star. Let's just align all of them at the end. And as you see here, now we see that the second item is just aligned at the top of the cross axis. Use align self if you just want to move one item instead of all of the items. But if you want to move the whole container, don't use align self. Okay, let's just comment that out. Take to align items from the Flexbox parent, which will move all of the items from the container to a specific position on the cross axis. Okay, use align self if you just want to move one item and use align items from the flexbox parent if you want to move all of the items following this cross axis of a specific position.